getting ready for some. A little uneasy about what you're doing there. For that. <laughs> hey, welcome back to our stupid reaction scene. It's up, Corbin. I'm Rick. And you can follow us on Instagram, Instagram and, and Twitter, Twitter for more juicy content. It's so juicy. What? Instagram and Twitter for more juicy content. Instagram sounds almost like a service for people who want a grandmother. Just add water. Instagram. <sighs> I think most of us on Patreon and follow your Twitter account. Today we were reacting to a, uh, a live performance from <gasps> a, a, a different playback singer. Oh, sorry, I thought it already started. Who we have never uh, listened to before. By the way, you may already know this, but I recently found out that during the big awards shows, mm -hmm. they give out awards, like they give their Oscar equivalent to studio singers that do background singing. Oh, cool. It's an actual category That's good. that you can win in. Like negative role. Exactly, like negative role, uh, which is the film fair, but like the national awards as well. They've got... Uh, they've got some interesting categories for their awards, and that's one of them. Yeah, well, we are reacting to this gentleman. Say his name for me, please. Sonu, and I may, may mispronounce the last name. I may have not gotten the first one. Sonu Nigam. And he's known for a lot. Been around uh, for a little while. He did Om Shanti Om. Om Shanti Om. He did Kal Ho Na Ho. Kal. No, that's not right. And then Kabi Koshi Kabi Gum. Kabi Koshi Kabi Gum. And then a ton Sami of other stuff. Gun. So it looks like he did. Kabi Kabi Koshi Gun. Toilet Sanju. Oh uh, no. And uh, obviously, there's a ton of stuff that I just don't recognize. His work went in the toilet. <laughs> I don't believe it did. Uh, he did get that right. Oh, he was a playback singer for PK. So, yes, he is somebody we don't know about, but have heard. Multiple uh, times. Didn't realize it. Yep. And I told you I wanted to, you know, start researching all the playback singers. Hey, has he won any of the awards, the aforementioned awards I was just referring to? 22 wins and 31 nominations. Well, pardon me all over the place. Uh, but, yes. And this is a song of his. This is him live. This is him live. in the shower, drinking a cup of coffee. Waving at passersby. This is him unplugged. Oh, wow. I think, I think it's MTV. So he's robotic. In yes. other words, most of the time he has to be plugged into a power source. Yes. And uh, MTV, mm -hmm. music television for all of you who've never heard of that channel. It doesn't play music anymore. Uh, but it's called Abai Mujai Main Khan. Watch your language. Yes. Here we go. Sochne wale, ab se kuch ek mahine pehle, dunia ko chhod ke chale gaye. 
at the age of 42. Ajay Jingran. I always miss his eyes, his spirit. So this is my tribute to Ajay Jingran. Bite jo bhoome teri, wo hi pal hai zindagi. Bite jo bhoome teri, wo hi pal hai zindagi.
Thank you very much. Dang. Uh, it still amazes me every single time we hear, and they do those things that aren't in Western music, the, uh, when they yeah. go uh, in between. Yeah. Is that what it is? Yeah. They're kind of going in between when they're singing and they kind of go, they're hey, and then they go, uh, uh, uh. Yeah, the vocal I don't know what it's called, I'm crazy. sorry. Uh, yeah, well, there's two things going on. It's the notes that they're hitting in between that we don't in Western music, mm -hmm. and the, the complexity of the, uh, for lack of the, for, in layman's terms, the vocal gymnastics, mm -hmm. where you can go all over the place with your voice, in Western music, people know somebody who does that to a point where she's considered an over-singer a lot is Christina uh, Aguilera, mm. uh, who has just transcendent control over her apparatus. Uh, I w but, but even in that respect, it's not like that. Yeah. And that was a gorgeous song. Uh, I wish we I wish we knew what he was singing, yeah. lyrically. And what, I, I, and what he was saying in the middle, I didn't know that he was going to be uh, talking that right, much. He's clearly dedicating it. But he's dedicating it to somebody. Yeah. Um, but we didn't get who it was. But man, and I thought I, I can't place on what song it is, but I feel like I've recognized him. It, that voice. I'm it sure. It could be from PK. I'm uh, sure. Because obviously we saw the film and if he's a singer in it, um, I, that might be where I recognize from, but I recognize the voice from something. Yep. Uh, I just can't specifically place it like I can with, um, what's her face? Letta. Uh, no, let it hold that <laughs> and uh, the the one from Bastrami uh, Mosanani. We've raked a couple of oh, yeah. playbacks. Um, uh, um, I just always forget her name. So you Josha, right? Yes. So I forget the first name. Josha is the last name. So, uh, sorry. Anyway, sorry. We're still babies. And the uh, the and and shout out to whoever said let's do this with a real piano because you can't. There's incredible digitized sounds of pianos that you can really, for the most part not differentiate mm. much but I could tell when they were doing that right at the outset that they were using a real piano and there's just something about that real sound and that piano player was how do, how do each of the musicians know like when the singer he put out his hand to the, mm -hmm. the how does it, how do they know what that means because they've rehearsed it oh, okay so they've rehearsed it and they know a moment's coming up and it's or if they're doing something purely improvisational he may decide he's going to stop singing and he'll point and that's the signal. Sometimes it's not even um, just, written out what they're supposed to do. It's just They just know that for the next 18 bars there's, there's going to be instrumental solo. And so he just points to the piano player. He probably knew the piano player was going to do the solo and was just affirming it's time to focus on the piano player. Mm, yeah. yeah. But, and that band was it, what they call tight, like together. Seamless, yeah. one one body of music together. That was such a beautiful song. Beautiful song. Uh, I would like to learn more from him and other playback singers, so let us know which ones down below and send us links. And please put in the comments who that was dedicated to. Yeah, let us know all he would have sang, because yeah. I, I didn't know it was in there, so I'm sorry.